Hi everyone, in this video I want to talk about a very interesting book that you can use to bridge the gap between say calculus and higher level mathematics. The book is called A Transition to Advanced Mathematics. So this is what's called like a logic and proof book. So typically a math major will take a course where they learn about mathematical logic and how to write proofs. And this book is an excellent choice uh, for such a course. Let's take a look further inside this book. So the book starts with logic and proofs. So it talks about all of the important stuff um, that you should know about mathematical logic. Then it goes on to set theory. And then it goes on to relations. All very, very core topics uh, in mathematics talks about partitions, ordering relations and graphs. Then it goes on to the ever important topic of functions. It's very nice that it has a chapter on cardinality. Uh, a lot of books don't have this and typically this is where you would find it in a good logic and proof book like this one. Then it goes on to groups which I think is really nice and it even talks about uh, rings and fields. So kind of a nice bonus for a logic and proof book. Then it goes on to some concepts from analysis. So it actually has uh, some, some mathematical analysis and some group theory. Uh, very, very, very excellent. The book is an excellent read. Uh, it reads like a math book, but like a really good one. It's really, really good for beginners because it shows all of the steps and uh, it doesn't skip a lot of steps. After all, this is a logic and proof book. So this is a book uh, that you would use uh, before you studied, say, abstract algebra or advanced calculus. You would study this before studying those subjects. So this book does a really good job in terms of readability. The exercises in this book are extremely good. Um, also, there are partial solutions to lots of the exercises, and several of those solutions are actually quite detailed. So it's a really, really, really good book um, to learn some higher level mathematics. This is the section on groups. You can see it does talk about group theory in the book. And here it's defining the symmetric group on n symbols. So it does talk about permutation groups. Excellent, excellent um, advantage to this book. Not all logic and proof books do this. Um, so that really sets this one apart from the other ones. It talks about sequences, which is a topic that you would see at the beginning of an advanced calculus course. So by reading through this book and working through most of it, you will have uh, a nice advantage when you take abstract algebra and advanced calculus because it has algebra and it also has uh, some advanced calculus in it. This is just a quick glimpse at the solutions. As you can see, they're quite detailed, which is very, very nice for a math book. And this is the kind of book that you would need uh, if you were to learn to write proofs on your own. So again, the book is A Transition to Advanced Mathematics. This is the sixth edition, and the authors are Douglas Smith, Maurice Egan, and Richard St. Andre. That's it.